Hey guys, what's up? I'm Camille from the Scully Twins and today I'm joined with... I'm Rafael, I'm from Brazil. Hi guys, and today I'm gonna lead you through a very nice power vinyasa flow for you to overcome some limits of your body. Don't, don't judge the capacity of your body and let's just have fun. Exactly, so I'm gonna uh, let you the social media link of Rafael in the comment section. So let's do this, let's get started guys. Let's play. Yes. Mm. So let's start our practice. Let's always stand up in front of your mat, your feet apart, aligned with your hips, really spreading your toes on your mat, your tailbone not out, but really in, contracting your core, open your chest, shoulders down, arms beside your body, open your fingers and taking your time to close your eyes. And you start feeling the connection between your feet and the floor, Let's scan our body, feeling your legs, your knees. Awareness to the sensations in your hips, in your pelvis. Feeling your abdominal area, feeling your internal organs. Your chest, feeling your heart center. Awareness to your shoulders, your arms, your elbows and your hands. Feeling the sensations in your neck. Feeling the sensations in your face and moving your awareness to your normal and natural breath. And start breathing only through your nose from now on throughout the whole practice. And at the same time, when you inhale, you feel your stomach expanding. And when you exhale, you feel your stomach contracting. Inhale through your nose, your stomach expand. Exhale through your nose, your stomach contract. And keeping the pattern of your breath like this throughout the practice, through your nose and your stomach. And gently, you can open your eyes, interlocking your fingers, bringing your hands behind your back. Elbows close to each other and exhale, bringing your chin to your chest. Let's start gentle with our body awakening some parts, awakening some joints. Breathe, keeping your chest open. And inhale, bringing your head back to the center. Your hands in front of your chest, palm of your hands facing forward. And you start stretching your arms all the way to the front. And in your inhalation, raising your arms all the way up, palm of your hands facing to the sky. And here, bringing your weight to your right foot and bringing your left leg all the way to the front. And you start drawing circles with your feet, with your foot in one direction. Anchor rotation, changing the direction, the same movement in the other side. Nice. Bringing your left leg all the way back, crossing the other one, placing your foot on the floor and spreading the left side of your body. Keeping your arms straight, breathe. Nice. Inhale, coming back to the center with your hands, bringing your left leg all the way to the back. Bringing your left leg all the way to the front, bend your knee and inhale, straightening your leg to the front, exhale, bending your knee. Inhale, strengthening, exhale, and once again, inhale, strengthening, exhale, bending your knee, bringing your foot back to your mat, bringing your hands together and start drawing figure eight in your wrist, in one direction. The same in the other direction, it's kind of coordination, sometimes it's not so easy. And let's do it again in the other side, bringing your hands behind your head, elbows close to each other, exhale, chin to your chest. Breathe here, start feeling the expansion in the back part of your neck few more breaths and inhale bringing your head back to the center palm of your hands facing to the front in front of your chest 
and you start to bring in your arms forward until they are straight and in your inhalation raising your arms all the way up palm of your hands facing to the sky nice and this time you bring in your weight to your left foot and raising your right leg to the front starting your ankle rotation in one direction starting your ankle rotation in the other direction you can gaze a fixed point in front of you to find your balance easier nice and bringing your right leg all to the back crossing the other leg placing your foot on the floor and spread in the right side of your body nice let's start awakening our body slowly a few more breaths and inhale bringing your arms back to the center your right leg all the way to the back right leg all the way to the front bending your knee and inhale straightening your leg to the front exhale bending inhale straightening exhale bending last one inhale straightening exhale bending bringing your foot back to the floor releasing your arms beside your body so find your samastit pose keeping your big toes together your heels apart in a way that the external part of your feet are parallel with each other once again your tailbone in Open your chest, shoulders down, arms beside your body. And in your inhalation, raising your arms all the way up to the sky. Exhale, falling forward through your hips, bringing your nose to your knees. Inhale, halfway up, spine straight, looking front. Exhale, hands back to your mat, bringing your right foot to the back, right knee on the floor, raising your torso and your arms all the way up in low lunge. Exhale, sink deeper in your hips. Few breaths here. Palm of your hands facing each other. Exhale, hands back to your mat and straighten in your left leg. Your front foot flat. Inhale, spine straight, looking front. Exhale, falling forward and breathe. Breathing through your stomach, breathing through your nose. Inhale, lengthen your spine, bending your knee, bringing the palm of your hands to your mat. Tucking your back toe, raising your right knee out of the floor. And inhale, left foot close to the right. Exhale, knees to the floor, chest and chin to the floor, keeping your elbows close to your body. When you inhale, open your chest without using your hands in cobra, just the contraction of your lower back. Breathe, feeling this muscle. Exhale, palm of your hands to your mat, tucking your toes and coming to our first downward facing dog. Here, if you want, you can pedal your feet up and down, bringing one heel up, the other down. Really spreading your hands, keeping your head between your biceps. Try to keep a gentle contraction in your core to bring your hips as up as back as possible. And in your inhalation, raising your right leg all the way up. And exhale, placing the sole of your right foot between your hands. Left knee down on the floor, raising your torso and your arms all the way up. In low lunge on the other side. Exhale, sink deeper in your hips. Few breaths here. Feeling your gentle balance. And exhale, hands back to your mat, straightening your right leg. Right foot flat, inhale, spine straight, looking front. Exhale, falling forward, chin to your chest. And breathe. Inhale, lengthen your spine, bending your knee, bringing your hands back to the center. And inhale, left foot close to the right, halfway up, spine straight. Exhale, falling forward. Inhale, rolling your torso, rolling your arms all the way up. Exhale, releasing. Let's keep going. Inhale, arms all the way up to the sky. Exhale, falling forward through your hips. Inhale, halfway up, spine straight, looking front. Exhale, hands back to your mat, this time your left foot back. Without tucking your knee on the floor, raising your torso and your arms in high lunge. 
Open your chest, palm of your hands facing each other. Observe if your front knee is really bent 90 degrees, if your back leg is really straight and active. And here, bringing your arms in cactus, arms, elbows aligned with your shoulders. Exhale, your knees to the floor. Inhale, up. Exhale, your knees down to the floor. Inhale, up. Two more times, exhale. Inhale. Once again, exhale. Inhale, arms above your head in your inhalation. Exhale, palm of your hands on the floor. And when you inhale, open your chest, raising your right arm all the way up and gaze your right hand. Few more breaths here in this gentle twist. Exhale, hands back to your mat. And inhale, right foot close to the left in plank pose. Exhale, down yourself now in Chaturanga, chest close to the floor, elbows close to your body. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward dog for five breaths. Breathe through your nose and your stomach. And inhale, raising your left leg all the way up. And exhale, placing the sole of your left foot between your hands, raising your torso and your arms in high lunge in the other side. Once again, keeping your bend in your front knee 90 degrees, back leg straight and active. Bringing your arms in cactus arms, and exhale, knee close to the floor. Inhale up. Exhale, close. Inhale up. Two more times. Exhale. Inhale, last one, exhale, inhale. Arm in front and the top of your head. Exhale, hands back to your mat. And inhale, raising your left arm all the way up, raising your left hand. Keep breathing, hold for a while here. Exhale, hands back to your mat. Inhale, right foot close to the left, halfway up, spine straight. Exhale, falling forward. Inhale, rolling your torso, rolling your arms all the way up. Exhale, arms beside your body. Once again, in Samastiti, observe your big toes together, your heels apart. And let's keep flowing in your inhalation, raising your arms all the way up. Exhale, falling forward through your hips. Inhale, halfway up, spine straight, look in front. Exhale, hands back to your mat. Inhale, this time jumping or walking to plank pose. When you exhale, bending your elbows, coming down in Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. And exhale, downward dog for five breaths. In your next inhalation, raising your right leg all the way up. And exhale, right knee to your right elbow and hold. Some core. Inhale, up. Exhale, right knee to your left elbow and hold. Inhale, up. Exhale, right knee to your nose and hold. Let's do it without stopping. Inhale up. Exhale to your right elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your left elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your nose. Once again, inhale up. Exhale to your right elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your left elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your nose. Inhale up, exhale to your right elbow. Inhale up, exhale to your left elbow and hold here. Straightening your right leg, bringing your foot on the floor, raising your left arm, open your chest, look into the front or to the ceiling, breathe. Exhale, hands back to your mat. And inhale, right leg all the way up. 
Exhale your right knee to your nose and placing your knee down on the floor in pigeon pose. Trying to bring your back leg as back as possible. Open your chest, open your throat, and exhale, falling forward. Place one hand in the top of the other one and your head down on the floor. Let's stay here for a few breaths. Try to be passive in this pose. Just the gravity taking place. Try not to tense any muscle. Inhale, roll in your torso, palm of your hands back to your mat. Tucking your back toe, raising your back knee. Inhale, right leg all the way up. Exhale, right foot on the floor, five breaths in our downward facing dog. Inhale, looking between your hands, jumping or walking to the front of your mat. Halfway up, spine straight. Exhale, falling forward. Inhale, rolling your torso, rolling your arms all the way up. Exhale, once again in Samastiti. So we have the other side. Inhale, raising your arms all the way up. Exhale, falling forward through your hips. Inhale, halfway up, spine straight, looking front. Exhale, hands back to your mat. Inhale, jumping or walking to plank pose. Exhale, down in Chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog, contracting your lower back. Exhale, downward dog for five breaths. Inhale, raising your left leg all the way up. Exhale, left knee to your left elbow and hold. Core. Inhale up. Exhale, left knee to your right elbow and hold. Inhale up. Exhale, left knee to your nose and hold. We are gonna do it without stopping. Inhale up. Exhale to your left elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your right elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your nose. Inhale up. Exhale to your left elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your right elbow. Inhale up. Exhale to your nose. Inhale up. Exhale left elbow. Inhale up. Exhale your right elbow and hold. Straightening your left leg, placing your foot on the floor, raising your right arm up, gazing to the ceiling, open your chest. Breathe. Exhale your hands back to your mat. Inhale your left foot all the way up. Exhale your left knee to your nose and placing your knee on the floor in pigeon pose. In the other side, bringing your back leg as back as possible. Open your chest, open your throat, and exhale, falling forward. One hand in the top of the other one, placing your forehead down on the floor. And let's hold here. Keeping your awareness in your breath, in the rhythm of your breath, through your nose, through your stomach. Few more breaths. Exhale. 
And inhale, bringing your torso up, the palm of your hands on your mat. Tucking your back toe, raising your right knee. And inhale, left leg all the way up. Exhale, left foot on the floor, five breaths in our downward facing dog. Inhale, look into your hands and jumping to cross your legs and sit down in your mat. Straightening your legs in Dandasana. Taking the flat between your bone on the floor. Keeping your toes pointing up to the sky. Keeping your chest open, the contraction in your core. And holding here for a few breaths. Five minutes. And from here in Dandasana, raising your arms parallel with the floor. A few more breaths here and raising your arms all the way up. And start walking to the back using some muscles you are not used to. Open your chest. Nice. And walking all the way to the front. That's a nice one. <laughs> and once again to the back. And once again to the front. Bringing your arms parallel to the floor. And in a count of 10, we are going to start coming down in 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. You stop where you are and you start drawing circles with your arms in one direction. The other direction. And down to the right and to the left. Hands back to the center and in five, four, three, two, one. Release down, bringing your knees to your chest, hugging your knees and rocking side to side, to the right and to the left. Massaging your back. Rocking up and down, massaging your spine, massaging your lower back. And bringing your arms on the floor, away from your body, aligned with your shoulders. And in your exhalation, dropping your knees to the left side on the floor. Bringing your head to the right, gazing your right hand. Here, trying to keep both of your shoulders on the floor. And breathing through your stomach, massaging your internal organs in this gentle twist. Inhale, coming back to the center with your knees. And exhale, knees to the right. Head to the left, gazing your left hand. And once again, keeping your shoulders on the floor and breathing through your stomach. Once again, massaging your internal organs. Inhale, raising and bringing your knees back to the center. And this time, raising your legs all the way up, raising your arms all the way up. You can have a gentle bend in your knee, just to give our legs and our arms an inversion. Allow the blood to flow in the opposite direction it's used to. Few more breaths. And exhale, bringing your right leg all the way to the floor. Inhale up. 
Exhale your left leg to the floor. Inhale all the way up. Exhale your right arm to the floor. Inhale up. Exhale your left arm to the floor. Inhale up. Exhale both of your legs down to the floor. Inhale up. Exhale both of your arms on the floor. Inhale up. And finally exhale, bringing both of your legs on the floor. Keep them there. Bringing your arms beside your body on the floor, the palm of your hands facing to the sky into your soul-deserved Savasana, keeping your eyes closed until the end of the, the practice. So thank you guys for practicing with me. Thank you for the trust. I hope you guys enjoy this fluid vinyasa flow. And thank you, Kami, for inviting me to this practice. My pleasure. Thank you to Rafael. It was an amazing class. And once again, I'm going to leave his link of social media down below. So make sure to go give him a follow. Thank you every, everyone so much. And have a beautiful day. Namaste. Namaste.